It is what it is. Good morning, family. It is truthfully a blessing that the Lord has made. You know, family, people that, that vibrate on a very low vibrational frequency, negativity, envy, jealousy, and hate, and hate is the vibration that they feel comfortable with and dishing out, it, but it makes them happy until it happens to them. Ultimately, people love to see you down that vibrate on these very low vibrational frequencies because in reality, they don't care nothing about you or what you have going on, especially when you're standing on business. While you're standing on business, they standing on isness. Meaning, this ish that they standing on is shit. Excuse my language. But they get a kick out of tearing you down because this is how they get their energy because the the God of unhappiness is the God of restlessness on an evil level. Their God is not the God of heaven. Their God is the God of earth. Cast down from out of heaven is where their God and all of his followers and the ones that were confused, they lost all melanin once their feet hit the earth of the dirt of the earth. They lost all color. To know the difference, to be able to differentiate from, you know, what they know is godly and moral, they figured, man, we can do what we want to do. We gods, and they're right compared to who we are. They are gods. And the Bible makes it clear. Ye are all gods, gods of the most high. But people that vibrate on that very low vibrational frequency, and anytime they see you standing on business, Avoiding people like that is a way to truthfully overstand what's going on. You did? And always giving the honor and the glory and the praise to Father God in heaven who sits on the throne. And, uh, you know, oh, we gonna unpack it today. You may as well check this young Dolph case for what it really, really is. It's a case of the King of Memphis being black. That's what this is. Because if young Dolph had been any other color besides we have some answers, just like that. Oh, it wouldn't take this long. But they can't see. The American government judicial system is hell bent on playing what they call holy. Like they just don't stand. These are these United Snakes of America that brainwash a lot of our people into believing that we came over here on slave ships. We were already here. The African is the first human being on earth. The fallen angels are the second. They only been here and in power. See, they had different cloning stages to get to this white man that you see. Out here causing all this hell. Everywhere he go, he don't leave. He loves the smell of death and he loves the smell of rotten flesh so much he preferred to eat raw fish eggs and have his woman do the same. This is a delicacy to them. Envy, jealousy, and hate. 
you're constantly finding giants over here all across the country and all across the world. Who y'all think they is? All of this hell that's being caused is caused by a set of people who want to be in control of everything, take away the physical dollar and turn it over to a digital dollar. The same people that took the music away from us that promotes the killing after all praise to Allah and all of the anguish, all of the hate. The only music genre that promotes the degradation and hate of the black woman. Call your woman a hoe. Mistreat her. She's a bitch. This is what they teach. This is what they allow us to put out into the world in order for us to get paid in their world. And they claim they all about Jesus Christ, but ain't none of this madness right. It doesn't exhibit or exemplify what Jesus, the Lord, and the so-called Savior is all about. It only <clears throat> has a vision to promote white supremacy with a form of godliness. But all the real holiness, they take it out. It's about killing with these people. They know they have done wrong by us. They don't want to give us reparations because all of us didn't come over here on those slave ships. This is a white man's world. And they want you to accept the Jesus that they give you, not the one that God in the Holy Bible gives you, which has hair of wool, which is ours, skin of bronze, which is ours. Eyes of fiery coal, just like the Creator, which is ours. Everything God say don't do, the devil say do. They claim that they are the God, but the Bible makes it clear we are all gods. We are all gods, gods of the Most High. But that don't mean go and create a God for somebody to follow while commissioning all of this killing and then tell me that Jesus, the one that y'all gave us, y'all know that there's a passage in the Bible that says, where Jesus says, obey these slave masters. Which Jesus said that? Because my God tell me it's masculinity. We're against that bullshit. There's only one God. There's only one Jesus. And it's the one that the Pope just revealed who he is. Don't get mad because the truth hurt. Damn it. Damn it. It hurt because all y'all cause is pain, suffering, and hurt. Slow dragging on this young thug case. Y'all know that ain't no Rico. That's some Oreo shit. That y'all want to turn brothers against their own brothers like COINTELPRO, so on and so on, and so on and so on. I'm making Oreos, which are hoes, appear like they are those that are all about the truth. You know, it's all about killing the original man, the original spirit of God, which is the Holy Spirit that he put and is still inside of us. It's not about following some fake sh just because you know, you know, it, it's, it's going to help you get back. So you would rather mislead your people. All you fakes and TD fakes. And all about the health flows and heifers and dollars. Y'all would rather mislead the people, teach lies, long as it can line your pocket with millions and put you in a better lifestyle knowing damn well that that book has been tampered with you would rather not tell your people the truth ain't y'all grandmama ever told y'all y'all great grandmother was Indian that ain't because we had some sex with them white imposter Indians that they gave us more five dollar ass Indians it's time to start doing research and recognizing what this is all about damn it the truth gonna hurt but that don't mean follow a lie that'll put your ass and keep you in the dirt. If you ain't gonna let God water that dirt and plant positive seeds, then you deserve to be a hoe. Just like one down on your fucking knees. Justice for young Dolph.
is and takes off and everyone else mentioned in the description box. Embrace the Holy Spirit and the power of God and always go to work on a plan to stay ahead, stay ready to keep them getting ready. Damn it, it's the constant battle dealing with these phrases. Assalamu alaikum and stay true.